Solid Edge supports modern product development processes, allowing you to do more with your resources and enabling new ways of working. First up is a new preview mode for large assemblies. Assembly Preview Open allows users to reduce the amount of data loaded, allowing assemblies of any size to be opened in seconds for the quick review of a design. Users can manipulate the view, change view styles, hide and show parts, or change display configurations. Here, we'll reduce the scope of what needs to load by showing just the main unit of this dosing machine before loading the assembly into edit mode. Another time saver is the ability to rapidly add strengthening gussets, typically used in structural frames. A gusset may be placed simply by selecting the adjacent faces of appropriate parts. They can also be applied to cylindrical faces. Users have full control over the placement position, including angle and gussets are included in the bill of material for the assembly. Continuing with the internal components theme introduced in the last release, Solid Edge now provides the ability to create new internal components using assembly modeling capabilities. Here we have a pneumatic cylinder assembly which has been imported as an internal component structure. An additional bracket is required, but as it's part of a purchased assembly, we'll model it as an internal component. Defining it as a sheet metal part, we can also give it a name and material. Looking at the home ribbon, we can see that we have a full range of sketching and modeling tools at our disposal in the assembly modeling environment. As we sketch the profile for each sheet metal bracket, a new context toolbar provides the most logical functions based on the type of object selected. This makes quick work of applying relationships and dimensions on the geometry. Dragging the sketch creates a contour flange where the length and thickness can then be defined, followed by some corner breaks. Some additional holes will help assemble the bracket. This can be easily generated by referencing geometry from the surrounding physical and internal components. The Pathfinder provides access to the material to be amended along with the gauge properties for the part if necessary. The list of features that have been modeled can also be seen. Once the internal component is complete, the Relationship Assistant makes light work of creating the correct assembly constraints. The operation of the dosing system can then be simulated even though the cylinder consists entirely of internal components. The new component finder speeds the process of locating parts. Simply enter the first letters of the name and the selective list displays the valid matches. A new synchronous radiate capability dramatically speeds the ability to edit cylindrical geometry. Simply select the faces that need changing by using shortcuts to speed the process. As the geometry is changed, design intent rules can be used to control the result. The depth of the pocket shown here needs to remain fixed, so the Move Faces option provides the flexibility to control this by retaining the original geometry. A new Assign Capture Fit command allows relationships to be predefined in common parts which allows them to be automatically assembled. Here we can see the relationship group of this handle component. Adding an additional planar align will complete this group definition. Placing the handle into our assembly and then selecting both target components automatically assembles them. Placing another handle, the identify targets option visualizes the matching components. Confirming the action assembles them at all five locations. For this fastener, there are a lot of matching locations, many of which are not required. The toggle component option allows a quick fence select to rapidly place the remaining 16 instances. Solid Edge introduces the ability to reference point cloud scans in order to visualize a design in its intended environment. The command supports all common formats. Full control over point density and size is available. The point cloud can easily be repositioned in relation to the Solid Edge model, and clipping planes can be used to focus on a required area of the design. Displaying the tank and piping that feed the dosing unit, we can see that its position isn't ideal and needs relocating. A quick positional edit will fix this. Measurements can even be made between the model and scan geometry to ensure correct clearances. Working in partnership with our customers, we've added more than 500 enhancements to our latest release. These are just a few. Solid Edge, engineered to grow your business by delivering enhanced core functionality, productivity, and performance to enable the digital twin.